the Roses um, follows King Henry VI and all of the courtiers and men in his life that influence him and the women, oh goodness, his wife too. Um, it starts when he's very young with the death of Henry V, who is his father, when he's nine months old. So he becomes king at nine months old and then the influences on him and on his court as he grows older and actually turns out to be probably not the best potential candidate to rule England at the time. Well, I'm playing Henry VI, which is actually a very interesting part for me, of course, seeing that I am a girl. But it's actually, it works, I believe, in this production very well because the character of Henry is probably one of the most caring and most thoughtful and not exactly I don't want to say kingly, because he's very kingly, I believe. I believe very much that he's kingly, because he's compassionate, and he really does care about his people. But in the eyes of many of the other court members, he's not ambitious and aggressive enough to rule the country. It's a good part for me, I believe, because in and on a stage full of these very tough men and these big fights, now I'm a smaller person with, you know, 5'3", smaller stature, and. I think I can portray Henry, especially younger, because he starts off in the show as nine years old and then gets older and older. I think I can portray him to a pretty good extent, contrasting with all of the other men and figures in the show, which are these large, big presences. Even my wife, um, played by Chelsea Fratty, Margaret, is this powerful presence in the show. And Henry's one of the quieter, more thoughtful, definitely prayer-oriented characters of the show. He would, in an instant, give up his throne, give up the crown, so that the Civil War would cease. And he says that several times throughout the show. And when it comes down to it, that's what I think makes a really good ruler, a really good leader, is someone who's going to put the people first. Well, being in the Shakespeare Festival is fantastic. I'm so, so excited to get to be a part of it, especially in a role like Henry VI which is a really unique experience for me, and I'm not sure if I'll ever get the opportunity to play quite so interesting a role as Henry VI in a very long time. So this has been an honor and a half, and I love Shakespeare, and I love the school, and I think that the festival is a fantastic, fantastic adventure every year, and being a part of it has been so much fun, so much fun.